What's up, everybody? This is Shadow from Shadow Cam, Wisconsin. We are here at the police station, city of Waukesha police station. They were probably so happy. Yeah. Hi, sir. Hello. How are you? Good. How are you? I'm all right. Is everything okay with you guys? Sure. Yeah. Everything's fine. Okay. Uh, our dispatch center just asked um, to find out what you guys were doing. This is out in public filming. What's your name and uh, badge number, sir? Officer Miller, number 362. Thank you very much. Sir? You name and badge number? What? Name and badge number, sir? Butron, B-U-T-R-Y-N. Thank you very much. 572. Are you going to be here a while? No. I'm okay. Not. Just don't obstruct the driveway as cars are going through. Thank you very much. All right. Can you do me a favor? Do you have an ID with you, sir? No, nah, I'm not going to ID. Okay. Do you have an ID with you, though? I'm not going to ID. Okay. Do you have a Minnesota ID? I have a Minnesota ID. Yeah, I, just, I would just like to tell you, State versus Turner, Driver versus Turner, 2017, 5th Circuit yep. Court of Appeals, that I have the right to stop and talk to you? This is not a stop and identify state. Okay. So, I, I, you could talk I, to me, I'm yeah. To ask you oh, most definitely, if, you could talk if, to me. If there's some reason that you're videotaping our headquarters there. Because I want to take some pictures. Because you want to take some pictures? Yep. Okay, I got no problem with you taking pictures. But you understand that we do have a certain heightened sense of awareness right now. No, I don't. I don't understand that. Well, that's what I'm. That's what I'm explaining to you. Oh now. well, I don't otherwise, agree with that. Otherwise, I wouldn't be bothering you at all. No problem. Like I said, almost every time, I'm 100 percent fine with everybody's right to tape and record anything that we're doing out here. Cool. If I don't do, if I'm not doing what I should do, then you have a responsibility to call me on it, right? Okay. So that's. Why well, I, that's I not think, why I was taping. So but no, but I think that I have the right to speak to you, and you disagree with me. Oh no, I don't. I don't disagree that you have a right to speak to me. Okay. You could okay. anybody can speak to anybody, and okay. that's okay. not a problem. Okay, but you can understand why I might be concerned. Or no, well, I don't. Well, I don't understand how why you're concerned. I, I'm uh, expressing to you that I am concerned, and the reason that I'm expressing to you that I'm concerned is that you're videotaping our building in a time when there is as much focus on law enforcement as there has ever been in this. Time. Okay. And the fact that you're going around recording license plates of under never recorded vehicles. a license plate, not I, a single one, I, not a single not undercover. I'm not saying that you didn't take I'm anybody's sorry. personal vehicle was not taped by a license plate. Anybody parked in a St. Paul police parking spot, yeah. okay, shouldn't matter. It's a government. It's a government vehicle. Right. And, 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 and I'm I'm telling you that I'm not saying you're wrong, but I'm saying you, to you this is why I'm concerned. You got you. Okay. Yeah, you have every right to be concerned. Okay. So. What I'm asking you is, will you tell me who you are? No. So that I have an understanding of why you... No, I will not tell you who I am. Okay. If I... No, I'm not going to tell you who I am. Okay. And you understand that I've just explained to you that the Fifth Circuit... What law did I break? No, I'm, I'm, I'm telling you... What law did I break? The Circuit Court of Appeals just came out with a decision in February that said that the police have a right to stop and identify a person who is videotaping regular workings of a police department. No, I don't believe that's true. I, I can show you. I, right I'll look it up. Definitely will. No, I'll show you right here. Oh, you, well, you can show me all you want. I'm going to investigate it on my own. Well, but I, I am, I want to make unless sure I'm breaking the law, I am not going to identify myself. Okay. So that's would, that's how that like goes. To, so What I would like to explain to you is I'm you, happy to show you this case. You can look on there if you like. What is it? It is... Right there, February 16, 2017. What's the uh, what's the case? Turner versus Driver. Turner versus Driver. Turner versus yep, Driver. I know Turner February versus Driver. And nowhere in there does it say you can ID me for taping a film for film in the police department. It does Show say me. I can detain you. You can detain me. And, and, and you're not being detained. I'm just stopping to talk to you. Okay. All right, then I'm going to go. And, and I'm asking you if you're If I'm not going to be detained, I'm going to go. You're you want to right to go. Okay. And have a I'm good day. I'm not detaining you. Thank you. All right, have a good day. Yes, you too. Officer. That man over there assaulted me. How did he assault you? He grabbed my camera. I have a scratch on my hand also. I have it on camera if uh, 
Did you educate them on the First Amendment of the Constitution? You want to show me the videos? So we we, 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 we okay. know about that already, but you were also in an okay. area that wasn't allowed to be in. You well, through the it, lobby, it, you were allowed to be in. Right. The other area is not. It's okay, but area. it's open. It was open door. But they asked you to leave. There's no sign or they nothing there. They asked you to leave. Okay, but there's no sign either. It matter. They asked you to leave. All right. That's well, what was the are you going to arrest me, sir? Am I, am, it's all no, good, I'm right? not going to arrest you. Okay, this man right here is the one that grabbed my camera okay. and assaulted me. All right. I told him to put Shut it away. I don't touch I told him to put it away. Okay. He was, he was very... I told him to put it away. It was okay. more than Step that. Step away from him. You're out in the public it was place. More than that. Right to, I'm actually there, recording though. you right now. Okay. It was more than that, officer. Okay. I mean, you can tell by the way his demeanor is. All right. Already. Give me just a minute. I'm going to talk to you over here. Okay. I'm going to stand over here. Is that okay? Let me go ahead. Well, my, my camera's actually broke from where he grabbed it. Right there. So, I don't know where the piece is, maybe inside. But that's where he grabbed okay. it. Is there a way I can view it? Yeah. Okay. I could show you. Let me show you real quick. If, uh, you don't mind. And, uh, sorry to cause any distress. I was just taking a picture of the lobby areas. This is a new building right here behind us, mm -hmm. and I wanted to check it out. Um, looks like it cost a lot of money. So I want to know where our money's going, you know? You live in Denton? Ah, I'm not going to answer that. Okay. So this is actually over four, right after that. What, what would you like to have happen? Let me answer uh, that. He needs to go to jail for uh, assault me. So, uh, the same that would happen to any other citizen assaulting any other okay. citizen. So for that to happen, I have to do, do a report. So I'm going to need your identifying information for that. Okay. Uh, I don't have ID. I don't carry ID in particular because uh, I do stories like this. Okay. Would you uh, able to give me your name, I could. address, date of birth? Are you going to promise you're going to arrest him for assault? I can't promise you that. No, it didn't happen in my presence of you. Okay. But well. I'll have to write a report on it. Okay, let me. That will go through if you do see this video and uh, it, it shows that he did assault me, will you arrest him? I'll have to view that first. Okay. Give me uh, what I'm doing. Is that okay? Hold that. Yes, sir. Thank you for being cordial. Mm -hmm. um, Let Go. Yeah, it's okay. probably broke now because. See that? And that's pretty much the ending there. Where are you claiming you're hurt at? Well, I mean, he just grabbed my camera. My camera's hurt. That's okay. pretty much assault so and robbery, he, right? If he, he did, grabbed. He didn't hurt you? Well, hurt I mean, you? he kind of kicked me in the balls a little bit, to tell you the truth. And that's what's really kind of pissed me off. <laughs> Honestly, you know? I mean, if it wasn't for that, I mean. You know, it'd been cool, but I mean, it, the fact that he kind of, whenever he came up to me, and I'm gonna do it to you, of course, because you're an officer. Um, whenever he came up to me, kind of gave me balls. So I don't know if that's. Depends on, did it cause you to feel pain? It did. Okay. I mean, would it cause you to feel pain? Overall, ball around him. Do you want to just go tell him not to be doing that kind of stuff? That he could be facing something. Yeah, and I already be... tried to explain it a little bit to him. All right, uh, he was. About what you were doing. Obviously. All right, well, you know what? I'm going to let him make it, I think. Uh, what do y'all think I should do, everybody? Physical injury is not a test of assault. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and post that video. Just let the uh, taxpayers of the county out, have them get calls after. Good, sir. How are you? Sir. How are you? He did assault me in there. I mean, you've seen it, right? Well, from your video, it it's hard to tell. I don't see exactly what happened. Like I said, I can write a report and that will go to our detectives and then they can figure it out from there. But as far as him going to jail today, it's not going to happen. Right. Okay. Of course. Um, and if I did, if I took something from you out of your hand, you'd be pissed, right? Yeah, I, I, I understand. And, you know, you'd probably want to, yeah, and that'd be some, understandable, you know? We have some criminal mischief. If you want to do criminal mischief for your camera, we can do that too. But like I said, it's all going to be a report. Be yeah, to I don't really want to be. Yeah, I don't want a report done okay. right now uh, at this time. Uh, so I'm just gonna go ahead and break contact and let y'all have a good day. You know, I'm glad you educated him and thank you for being cordial and 
you know, you guys have been really professional, and, you know, I'm thankful for that, you know. Have a good day. Hey, God bless, guys. The key word is, what if there's a window? Did you need help with something? No, no, I'm just uh, filming right now. Okay. Um, there's, I'm in a, am I in a restricted area? No, I just didn't know. Sometimes people come down here and can't find the office they're looking for. So. Oh, I okay. Uh, in that case, no. Um, I appreciate your time. Thank you. Uh -huh. Basically, again, you're on a sidewalk. You're in an area where you're allowed to be. Now, keep this in mind. This is public access to the police department and I don't push it if they sit there and says oh sir you have to go over there okay that would be a clear cut case now if you're a new auditor and you don't want to st uh, stir up the pot you might have a boring video but put it up anyways um, again this is not the police property in fact this guy here is blocking the sidewalk and that is illegal he, he can, if you and I did that we get a ticket this is what I mean by the thick blue line and it gets thicker by the minute we need to thin that out until it disappears completely now I would uh, I'm gonna go and ask them if they can move their vehicle because it's blocking uh, sidewalk now you get a lot of smirk Um, I, yes, I can. Hello, um, I'm here to ask one of you guys to move their cars. You're blocking a uh, sidewalk. What's up? One of your vehicles is blocking the sidewalk. One of the police cruisers? Yes, if someone is in a wheelchair, that's against federal law. On uh, federal handicap laws, are you familiar with that? Yeah, I'm not familiar with that one. I'll go you cannot, a yes, indeed. Uh, you should make it a, a, a point. And what is your policy about um, videotaping? Yes, indeed. I mean, she's telling me I can't film in there. That's that's not right. That's Filming not right. where? Inside the lobby there. Inside the lobby? That's yeah. not a problem. Indeed. She needs to be tra taught that. But anyways, I, I'm serious. If someone came in with a wheelchair, now my mother's handicapped. And you got this guy here uh, parked. So do you want to do something about it or do I have to file a complaint? This is not a simple thing. I realize you guys become numb at the law because you don't think it applies to you. Okay. I understand that. If I was in why, your position... Why do you say I don't think the law applies to me? When's the last time you arrested a police officer? When's the last time I arrested a police officer? I asked you first. When was the last time you arrested a police officer? You See, in your mind, you say, never. Not done. Why, why? I mean, if they break the law... No, no, that's not true. There's there's countless of videos of police officers breaking the law, and then the pardon will, goodbye, goodbye, goodbye type thing. No, you're above the law. I understand that. This just proves my point. So... Do I default? If, if you have a if you have a problem with a gun, file a complaint. Then you're not going to move it. No, I'm not going to move it. Well, whomever are they going to move it? No, go ahead and file a complaint. All right. I can't believe you. See, you just told me police officers don't violate the law, didn't right. you? Not. When did I tell you that? You just told me just now. I said police officers don't violate the law. When I asked you about arresting a police officer, I said I've never arrested a police officer. That okay. I mean, police officers don't violate the law. Okay, I semantics. Well, let me finish. You're talking. No, for I'm going to talk. What happens no, is right. you just okay. told me you just told me you just told me that police are not above the law. Correct? Sir, you can't film in here. Yeah, you can. How how does it make you guys look? You're blocking a, a sidewalk where you can't. Sir. Well, I know that. Stupid. May I have the complaint form? May I have the complaint form? All I ask is for them to move. And all they want to do is escalate the situation. I might, excuse me, am I being denied a complaint form? One second, sir. Very well. Just let her finish. Okay? Very well, but do you understand? It's a very simple request. You guys are blocking a sidewalk where a handicap can't go through. It's a very simple request. What is it? There's a, you have a vehicle out here that's completely blocking a sidewalk. Which one? The one, well, you have to come out here, because I can't describe it, they all look alike. Just the one that's blocking the sidewalk. 
I mean, are you guys above the law? This guy says the officers are not above the law. In the same breath, he says, no, I'm not going to move it. Okay, so that shows you guys being hypocritical, and you guys think you're above the law. I even asked him, I says, if you move it, or do I have to file a complaint? Well, his ego is in the way of what's right. And this guy here thinks police officers are above the law. He may not say it, but he does act like it. And I have a pen. I see what you're talking about. And this guy thinks, he tells me one breath, he tells me police are not above the law. I tell him he, they are. And he keeps saying, no, we're not. Is that true at that juncture? No, police can violate the law. We're just like everyone else. Right. And in the same breath, you tell me you're not going to move the vehicle. Part of that is, sir, a police car is never parked. Yes, I know. It is only stopped I know. I know. But I will address the situation. See, the thing is, the police could park anywhere, red zone, anything, because they have to be near their vehicle. Am I correct? No, it's just the fact that No, I'm talking about, okay, well, for example, you're not on a call, and maybe you went, uh, went on a break, and you parked in the red zone to go into a Denny's. You're allowed to do that because you have to be near your vehicle in this case of a call. Am I correct? Because that's your, that's your assumption. I park here because I have to because I'd be near the vehicle. That's more of a big city situation. Well, I'm from the big city. I'm from California. Okay, so the point is I'm saying this. This guy's telling me the police officers are not above the law. So when I try to tell him and articulate that a handicapped oh. person cannot go through the sidewalk. Hi, I'm Chief. How are you? Uh, Chief, may I, may I uh, point out something to you? Here. First of all, these guys are just tyrants, and I don't appreciate it. He's telling me that police officers are not above the law. I tell them they are above the law. He keeps telling me they're not above the law. Then I says, fine, then once you move this vehicle that's blocking the sidewalk... Okay, this is just this is this is a disgrace, an absolute disgrace. I can move that for you. Well, Chief, may I have your full name, please? Bob Winter. Yeah. Bob Winter, Chief of Police of Royal City. Yes. Do you think this is okay? No, it shouldn't be blocking it. it, it happens. This gentleman right here, Officer okay. Anderson. That's all right. I explained to him, and he's got his ego in the way, and I told him very politely. Well, and I even articulated, yeah. I even articulated, Chief. This is, a, you know, I told him, what if a handicap come by? My mother's handicapped. I picture her now in the street because you guys are, or these gentlemen, are too arrogant. Let's move it. That's where I told us. going to address it. Do you want to see the video? Do you want to see the video of the first guy? I don't care, sure. I mean, if you don't care, then I'll I give mean, you. I do. Yeah, sure, if you'd like to. No, well, the thing is, I, I, I was very polite. I says this can't be. Have I been polite to you? Yes, you have, Chief, right, and so I appreciate it. May gonna, I? We're going to move it, okay? I appreciate it. Please have a poly Well. If you see the video... I, I, will, I will check out... The, you know what it is? If you want to show it to me, you can. That's what I meant. Well, I have to turn on my other camera here. Okay, what it is, is you'll see the video that I, was, I thought I was polite, and I says, I know you guys think you're above the law. I, I think if you come on sometimes, people that approach other people in a conversation with cameras and stuff like that, it can be offensive. It may be offensive, but legal. One, two, they should right. be under, but at the law. I don't know that that's illegal either. Well, this is illegal. It's questionable. No, nope. there's still a path. Now, no, not for a wheelchair. For a wheelchair? I even told him I was I was going to cite the uh, uh, the federal handicap law, and he wouldn't listen. Okay. And All not right, only well, that. Move in the car. Have a good day. No, no. Well, yeah, but. Uh, the, I'm done. Have a good day. I know, but. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> what you're up to, mate? It's just photographing. Okay. What, what in particular are you photographing, mate? Just anything from public area. Yeah, no, I get that. I get that. Yeah. I'm just, like I say, you just speak to a couple of my bombs, that's all. You just come out and said, what's going on, so I said, so I don't know, come find out. Yeah, just, just uh, photographing. Okay. Are you photographing? It's right, a couple of them are suggesting you followed the police cars in with your camera. You, you sort of. Why do they have a problem with that? Hmm? Why do they have a problem well, with that? We don't have a problem with it. I'm just trying to find out why it is that you do okay. it, mate. Right, and what platforms you're going to be using, honestly. But uh, bear in mind what's happened over the weekend. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Everyone gets yeah. dead twitchy, don't you? So all I'm doing, mate, I'm just trying to find out exactly what it is that you're doing, and, and, and that's all it is. Okay. Have you been filming with police cars coming in and out of the police station? Is there anything that you might put somewhere that might cause us some issues? That's what I'm asking. I'm asking you to give due consideration for what you're doing and the yeah. safety of my police officers and the people that are inside that building. 
I'm feeling like you, you're making me account for a lawful activity, which I'm not yeah, going no, to no, do. No, 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 I'm just what, okay. what, what I'm trying what I'm trying to do, mate, is just trying to find out that you're not going you're not you're not putting stuff somewhere that perhaps it could be used in, in, for nefarious reasons or, or anything like that. That's all it is. Okay. I've got no problem with you setting up, photographing anything you want. I've got no issue with that at all. But potentially, when it starts, or when it could potentially impact on the people that are in that building and the people that are in the police cars coming to and throwing, then that's my issue then. So, well, I'm just going to carry on photographing. Yeah, I've got no because, problem with that. Okay. Just watch what you do with, your police, with the police cars, that's all. And okay. the people that are driving them, just give due consideration. You, mate, <clears throat> you might publish these on a website. Loads of people, loads of people uh, look yeah. at for photography reasons, general interest reasons. Yeah. You might also be posted on a website by people that actually, I know that person with Bobby, I know where they live. Yeah. See what I mean? Yeah, I do, but I, I think if it was a real concern, they would have made it illegal, wouldn't they? Well, no, I mean, the government don't no, think it's a real concern, no, what do What I'm suggesting is, what you are doing, isn't illegal at all, not a yeah, problem at all. Okay. Take photograph of, uh, you know, of police officers driving in and out, I just ask you to give a bit of consideration right. in relation to what it is that you're actually doing. Yeah. You wouldn't want preferential treatment, though, for the police station, would you? I mean, it's not exempt from photography, and neither no, are the all, people mate. coming no, in and all. out of it. Not at all. So, not at all. So, I'm just asking you to give due consideration yeah. for the safety of the people that work in the building and that are driving the police cars when they're not driving police cars, if that makes sense to you. Yeah. Because normally, if we've got somebody like the Sentinel or something like that taking photographs, they'll ask us if they want, if they want us to blur the faces of the people that are driving the police cars or the people that are out the, about the station. Yeah. That's normally a, a general consideration that's given okay. by general members of the press and stuff like that. Yeah. And again, you might not be a member of the press, okay? So you probably wouldn't ask that question. So no. all I'm saying is just give due consideration for the people that are in and out the building. That's all, mate. I'm, I'm going to carry on photographing. Yeah, yeah, you've got no problem with that. So what, well, where does that leave me then? If you don't want me to photograph them, but I no, am. No, no, I'm not. I'm not asking you not to photograph them. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just asking you to give due consideration for the people that are driving the vehicles. Okay. Yeah. Photograph the cars. The cars belong to the public, if, if anything. Do you know what I mean? That's yeah. why we tend not to block number plates out and stuff like that. If you're looking for, if you're looking for, a, you know, a police car, take a photograph of a police car. Yeah. The person that's driving the police car when they're not in the uniform is just yeah. like any other member of the public. Yeah. Have you ever heard of a website called RedTube? Oh, is that the porn one? No, no, no. There is one called Red Tube, though, isn't it, which is porn? No, not <laughs> That's one, not the one. It's Red Tube. There's okay. Some, there's some called Pig Watch as well. Oh, right. Uh, okay, no, I don't know that. Yeah, people put photographs on. Yeah. Do you know who this person is? Do you know where they live? Oh, oh right. No, I haven't seen yeah. that. That's what no, I'm I won't at. be doing that. That's what I'm getting at. I won't be going on Pig Watch or yeah. Red Tube. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Sure, yeah. <laughs> Uh, and obviously the other thing you've got to give to do is people walking past on their okay. chairs and all that sort of business. Yeah. Alright. I, I won't cause an obstruction. Thank you. Okay, Stop thank me. you. Sorry? Yeah, sorry, I found the police station earlier. Okay. Uh, everything okay? Yeah, everything's fine. Yeah, just wondering what you were, what you were doing. Obviously, Photographing. <laughs> Photographing. Photographing. What? Whatever I want to. Okay. Unless you think the police station's exempt. No, no, it's just obviously two police stations okay. in one day I've seen you. Oh, that's a bit strange, isn't it? Yeah. Unless I'm really into police stations. Okay. Just wondering what, what, what the crap was like. Okay. Are you from the press or...? No. No? no. You're, 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 is it yourself? You, you, you're just also... me. Me on me own. Yeah? Yeah. Are you local? Are you...? What's your name, please? Peace of Salt. Oh, what's, your, what's your number? 5503. Okay, what's your please? 24186. Name? Okay, you had to think then, didn't you? I did, yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, just photographing. What's your name, mate? I uh, don't need to give that, do I? Okay. I was wondering why, obviously, you were uh, filming outside of a police station. Well, two police stations in one day. Well, I, I didn't know there was a limit. There's no limit, is no, there? No, no, there's no limit. I just thought, thought, thought it was a bit strange how you were outside Hamley this morning, okay. and then now you're outside Longton. If I was just outside Hamley, they'd say it was strange, though. No, no I, 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 we thought you were a reporter for Crown Court and then thought the yeah. day was Sunday. No, it, it doesn't matter wherever so, I go, it's always strange. Wherever you go, it's strange. Is it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, right, okay. Yeah. Is that just your... your... N no, it's, it's virtually every photographer that goes out and does street photography. It's strange. It's strange okay. that you're doing here. You're obviously a terrorist in this day and age. The current climate, look what happened yesterday in New Zealand. It's all that, so... Okay. No, no. Okay, but it's okay to wonder. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's not against I, I the law to wonder, is it? No, I took something over Hanley, so that's it. There's no problem at all. Yeah. 
Take care. <laughs>